And there's a cops right there. All right, guys. We ran into the very back. Police just showed up. What is up guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. Today, as you can see, I'm sitting on a tennis court. We are at the abandoned tennis academy that was once owned by Serena Williams, one of the best women female tennis players ever. This is the tennis court she owned for the longest time. She wanted to bring up new students and all that kind of stuff and train new talent. It's abandoned, it's been sitting in abandoned for a while. I can't wait to show you guys this. Let's get right into it. Alright, so we have a couple beat up tennis courts here and over here are the nicer newer ones that look like they got redone but obviously it's been sitting abandoned now. All the uh, tarps on the edge, I guess maybe they wanted privacy from people like in the houses up there and stuff is what I'm thinking but I'm not too sure. But this is the actual building here guys. Alright, we are in between the buildings right now. And we're gonna try to see if we can get in to the building. This door's open, obviously. This gate has been pushed open, I guess. Let's go check out the other beat up tennis courts quickly. Not that that matters, because this one looks beat up pretty beat up. You can see it's overgrown here. And then, let me take the light off. Let me see it a little better. Yeah, this one's beat up just a little bit, guys. So, I just can't believe this one. This one's crazy. All right, let's stay on the main floor first and see what we can find. I'm gonna assume these are bathrooms, maybe? Change rooms? Oh boy. Well, I got a bathroom, right? <laughs> That's for sure. Okay, so this could have been a change room for either women or men, I don't know. And then obviously you put your change of clothes in here you run up there and you play the tennis and stuff. Probably shower, shower, toilet, toilet. I'm gonna assume this was the females because I don't see any urinals for the male. Let's see, oh no, it is the men. What? And then the women here. <laughs> Why is it the women's bathroom is always cleaner? Shower stalls, shower stalls are punched through the wall. Oh, what the hell? That's crazy. Huh. It's insane, guys. Oh, I keep thinking that was the stairs. All right, we're back outside, guys. It seems like this place is corridored off to different spots. You scared me. Oh, God. Dude, this is cool. It's like a cage here. This is like the meat locker. Yeah. This is where they probably kept their bottles of water, some food for the people at the academy. It's really good. I think a bit small for how much they can cater to here, in my opinion, but I don't know. Yeah, they would have had that there. Double locked door so no one could steal the food and all that stuff. And then a little bar here. I guess if you wanted water, probably would have been more than just stuff here. Maybe shoe rental, I don't know. Oh my God, is that a freaking pool? What the heck? I actually did not know there was a pool here. Uh, yeah. The giant grill down there. There's like a giant rotisserie grill. Where? Oh, yeah. There? Yeah. Yo. Yo. I don't know what's going on. Oh my god. That looks like a giant penis going down the stairs. What the hell? <laughs> it's crazy. I want to go check this grill he's talking about. He said there's a giant grill here. Yo, I can go for a barbecue. Yo! Okay, that's a little bit... Uh, I'm not going to go that side. 
This is pretty cool actually. Spotlights there, blue and a normal white one. But this looks really cool. I'm actually glad we got it to this place. I don't know what's behind here. I'm not gonna open that up, but. Oops. I wonder what these would have been. Maybe sinks? I just don't see any like water. Could have been a sink. I'm pretty sure that's a sink or something. Maybe you like you put ice in there for your coolers. Alright, I'm going behind the grill. Okay. So I don't see much. I thought maybe this was a bigger building, but it is not. What is this? Sand? And then light blue. Sport? Oh! This is like the floor stuff to make the, the tennis courts blue. I didn't know that was paint. I thought that was like um, the fake grass type thing. But it's a paint. Wow. Acrylic resurfacer. I did not know that was a, a surface. I thought it was like the fake grass but blue. That shows how much I know about tennis, obviously. <laughs> Maybe this would be supplies, paperwork for buying all the supplies, like the sand, the acrylic or surfacer, stuff like that, is what I'm assuming. All right, guys, I'm going to head towards the main building because we're losing daylight really fast, and I don't want to be spotted in here, so I want to get into the main building ASAP. All right, guys, so unfortunately, there's the cops right there. Cops know we're here. All right, guys, we ran to the very back. Police just showed up. And, um, yeah, we're trying to escape. You know, we gotta go this way. That's how Mo got out. There they are, right there. Yep. Yeah, it is. It's a cop. Alright guys, we just ran through the ravine to get away. Now we're just kind of waiting it out and playing hide and seek. Hopefully, when we get back to the van, they don't realize we were there. But, who knows. Someone wants to ride us out because it's pricing our lights in the property. So, we're going to see what happens. If there's going to be a police encounter in this video, 100%. Let's see how it goes down. Hey, is this one of them? Guys, is this one of them? Yeah. Alright guys, we're making our turn right now to go to the van. If there's a police car there, I think we're gonna have an encounter. We'll know in about 30 seconds. Yeah, we don't do that. <laughs> that truck has passed at least twice, three times. Okay. What was the inception for that one? Uh, Mexico. Mexico. Uh, Mexico. 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 Mexico.
<laughs> How's it got to? I have no idea. It stopped running our van. That's actually sick. What the fuck? That's so cool. Holy crap. Alright. Hello. Damn. Hey, Good. how are you? Why is there cops here? Is your van over there? Yeah. Yeah, we're doing random nautica hunting. Okay, so what were you guys doing inside the building then? We weren't in the building. We were back there in the sand dunes. And we went around Come the on, neighborhood. don't lie to me. Oh, I'm not lying. We're just, we do random nautica videos. You okay. know what random nautica is? I don't know random nautica is. Oh, you do? Did you see all this uh, equipment you got on? Yeah. We film random yeah, nautica Well, the person that called this. Get out of my face. Bro. Oh, sorry. The person that called this. Said that four people came from that van, went inside the building. Not oh, us. We weren't in the building. We were in the background, like in the sand. That van? That's our van. Yeah, we're from Canada. Yeah. Okay. Well, they said he came out of the van. And we never went in those buildings, but we were in the background, so maybe they seen our flashlight. Do you the have? Uh, do you have any ID on you? All four of you? Yep. Yeah, sure. Can we get it, please? <clears throat> but anyways, that building is. Um, Close to anyone going in there, there's a reason for that. Yeah, well, we're doing so we're doing locations. Uh -huh. So basically, uh, you know what random nautica is. You put in an intention, it takes you to find stuff oh, can or whatever. Get the thing, yeah. <coughs> yeah, I don't run, yeah, yeah. Can I get mine in the in the van, please? Or can give your name. Just your name. Oh, okay, okay. <coughs> That's what happened. I don't have an idea. You don't have an idea. Right? I don't know. Okay. Okay. I'll give you my name though. No, we're not doing yeah. nothing bad. We're just I'm making video. Work. Yeah, I'm just know. saying that's private property. Well, there's no way in, anyways. It's like all oh, fenced off, right? There's way in. So see how there's like a dirt track back there? Yeah, I'd be back there. It's yes. like an off-roading thing, I think. Yep. So we're doing intentions, and the intention was Mexico, and it brought us there. That's what we do. We like. So what did you, you what'd you do? Walk all the way around and come. Well, we got lost. <laughs> yeah. Because you gotta follow the intention. It looks like just one random dirt trail that goes through there. So. So you follow the intentions, which it gave us originally back here. We went there. It was just a nut, like a bucket, and then we just kept following another location, and it took us to all these like Christmas trees and stuff. But yeah, pretty boring video. Not gonna lie. I know. It, Mexico, you'd think you'd find like something, but how close is the border to here? I was about 13 miles. It goes straight. Yeah, we've never been here before. It's our first time in Arizona. <laughs> okay. So, you guys run a site or something like that? YouTube. What's it called? Mo Sarge is my YouTube channel. Okay. What do you guys do on, on this site? And what do you guys? Random nautica videos and paranormal. Yeah. I do like <coughs> alpha the show. He does like kid friendly <laughs> content, but he's yeah. trying out the random nautica stuff for the first time. All right, yeah. we're gonna run you guys real fast. Go for it. Yeah, if everything's no okay, then no stay problem. out of that building. We actually weren't in the building though. Okay, uh, well, if you decide you want to go in that building, stay out of that building. Okay, all right. right. It'd be called trespassing. You can't get oh, we're arrested. We're <clears throat> so, what is that building? It is. Old King's Court Tennis Court. Whenever we do, whenever right. we do locations that are like this, we get permission usually okay. um, with contracts and stuff. Like I've been doing this ten years full time. So okay. what, what's up with the building? Well, you heard of Jason from uh, Friday Thirteen? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. A lot of people got injured and were killed. Actually, are you serious? No. <laughs> oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> Those guys are clicked up. Cut the right there. The building is run down. <laughs> People go in there, they can get hurt. Yeah. Yeah. Floors oh drop out from under yeah. your windows, whatever. Yeah, it's like dangerous, I guess. To walk. I can see how, like, to people, like it may have seemed like because our lights <laughs> and stuff in the bushes, but we're filming random nautica out there. Okay. Yeah. But anyways, um, it's private property, so. Okay. Well, you thank you for there. being so awesome, though. Yeah. I can see how it's. Uh, All right. Weird. Uh, A L D O. Uh, I guess you guys. H A. Two that he ran. Does, you guys don't have F any uh, warrants. Or? He's a no. No, I'd be putting uh, him for some. I hope so. That was the content, but I don't. Space after. Yeah, all the. Yeah, all the. You guys are from Canada? What part? Uh, Ottawa. Z I'm from Toronto. Niagara Falls. Easy at yeah. Easy at New York or Z. Or Canada side. The Canada side. Yeah. I'm in the region. I'm like literally like. 30 minutes from it, but I'm in the Niagara region, like that whole area. But I'm not technically in Niagara Falls. So, I've been Canada. Canada's a big place. So. How'd you guys all get together? Uh, we all know each other. Oh, you know what? We're bored as fuck in Canada. It's, there's snow there. <coughs> it's cold. I, yeah. I'll go to hell. To to Canada. <laughs> I don't see what my house looks like right now in Canada. No, I, look at this. It's <laughs> depressing as fuck. Hey, this, is, this is my house right now. A freaking blizzard. My poor wife has Sargi? Sar Sar Sargi? 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 Yes. What's your middle name? Uh, I don't really go by middle name, but Hassan, I guess. Like, you have a middle name? I guess so. Uh -oh. I'll start calling you Hassan. Hassan Sargi. H-A-S-A-N? Yeah. Okay. And for Angelo? Yep. 
No middle name. Huh? No middle name. No middle name. Okay. When you guys run it, we'll be contacted. Five minutes. The reason why we're out here is four ways. Sarji's middle name is Hassan, Henry Adam, Sam Adam, Nora. And had you pointed there and lied to me, you'd all be under arrest right now for false reporting. Can I tell you something? Yeah. Content is awesome enough, but I don't want to get arrested. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep bringing it up. No, I know, I know, I know. I know. So you're telling me you saw a crazy elf on the shelf running around the neighborhood? <laughs> what was your middle name? I don't have a middle name. And your date of birth? January 4, 1994. <laughs> Sorry, January, uh, January 4, 1994. Now you're recording this now? I, I record this. All right. And Can I put the up on the shelf thing? We, do we, we don't have your ID. Yeah, you do. Uh, uh, in the car. Mine's in the car. What is that? It's like it's <coughs> First name? Carlo. C A R L O. Last name P A O. L O. P A O. P A O. L O. L O. Z Z A. I know. Z Z A. Z A. Canadian say Z Z A. So Z? Is that how you say Z? Two Z. Yeah, two Z's and then a name. Okay. Date of birth? December 19th, 1978. Yeah, you got the gold one for one million. And your middle name? I don't have one. No middle name. Okay. I do like Perfect, thank you. Stuff. No problem. Yeah. 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 <coughs> yeah. Is that clear? Are you saying, is there alpha and running in the neighborhood? <laughs> <laughs> if you want, but I can catch you. Yeah, so I have a, a TV show on here. You guys got to be careful. I'll play the show. I'm the host of it. It's a pretty big announcement going on on History Channel 2 real soon. Really? Yeah. So it's a, it's, it's popping off. You know, it's good. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. All right. Okay, as soon as he gets done, we'll be out of your hair. No problem. And Take your time, man. Into your van. And no rush. Just, you know. Yeah, guys, apparently there's a crazy elf on the shelf running around the neighborhood. It's about to go home. So he, he likes to I guess uh, this adventure is over. <laughs> We're going to get out of here. You forgot to say cops from Phoenix, Arizona. Or something. So what? So it said cops are on scene from Phoenix, Arizona. Is this Phoenix or where are we? Like, so well, you don't want to. You don't, you don't, I'm just joking right? with you. Again. No, I know, but you don't want to be like known like from Tucson or. Is this Tucson? Yeah, yeah this is Tucson. Okay. Okay. Mo most of the time, because we travel so much, most of the time we don't know where we are. <clears throat> yeah, it's almost time to go back home. It's been like two weeks since I've seen the family. And, right. But you're going to go home to the snow? Oh my God. Not for long. I'm only there for two weeks and then heading to our beach house in the Dominican. So. <laughs> be nice. Was that from the, f the subscribers and YouTube? Well, yeah, I mean. You know, we have businesses and YouTube subscribers and stuff. And, you know, we've been grinding hard all the time. So you put, you guys put your, the work in. Yeah. 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 All right. Anything or? Delayed because of it being. Canada. Are you guys looking for warrants? Yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's good. Well, I mean, they let us all in the country. So. <laughs> yeah. True. Yeah. <laughs> well, did you know you actually can't make YouTube videos if you have a criminal record? YouTube removes you. you. Yeah, yeah, they delete, you. One, they delete one, you. A guy we used to know, he had a YouTube channel and he was always like talking shit about cops on his videos. They deleted his ass so quickly. Yeah, yeah I guess they gotta be policy friendly and all that stuff. And it's funny because my name is Muhammad and I never have any problems at the border. Never. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> no, I'm joking. What? I'm like, Angelo over here. <laughs> I think I always get you. And you let me in anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> yeah. You're out of here. So, do you guys get in trouble for being on cameras? Like, because I know some uh, officers are like, they don't want to be on, on YouTube or stuff. Like, how does that work? <laughs> no, we don't get in trouble for it. I'll dim it down a little bit. Oh, we're on cameras doing something wrong, I guess. Oh, uh, okay. So, they got cameras too, right? Like, right there on this vest? Those are recording. Oh, yeah, too, I didn't right? see that. Yep, yep. You guys have to record every time? Yep. Any time there's, a, anytime there's an interaction. I, is it true, sure, like, every time you guys turn on the uh, like the lights, it, the cameras turn on? The police lights? Yeah. Our, our dash cam. Oh, the dash cam. Yeah, that's cool. But some, some um, police agencies, yeah, their ca body cameras. Oh, that's cool. cool. So, what's it like out here? Is it dangerous? Is it crime? Or? You heard of uh, Jason? For no. <laughs> <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> hey, maybe I'll be famous someday. Start a TikTok. Show, yeah, show like the stuff that you. Yeah, we're close to the Mexican border. There's a lot of uh, drug trade and people trade. So wow. Be careful. Crazy. I'm sure Canada's like got, got its... Yeah, oh yeah, 100%. Yeah. We're starting to see a lot more crime in Canada now. It's not the Canada that it used to be 10 years ago. It's terrible. Oh, Is it the Americans coming across? No, no. It's, it's another story. 
I don't want to talk about it. Yeah. <laughs> It's just the cost of living is crazy. They're yeah. Legalizing all kinds of drugs. And Every drug is legal in Vancouver. Get out of here. Like fentanyl, you, you heroin. Can, like it's so stupid. Just show up yeah. to a safe zone, safe injection sites they call them, right. which is not safe at all. Um, and then in Vancouver, there's about 18 blocks. It kind of looks like, you know, when you drive through Skid Row in LA, yeah. it, it's like the Canadian version of that, essentially. Yeah. Just people and just nodding it's, it's, it's worse, yeah. It's, it's bad. It's yeah. crazy. I went to Vancouver for the, the first time to film my TV show over there, and I'm like, what the heck is this? There's like homeless encampments everywhere, like drug, parents. like it's it's something out of this world. And I've been to Skid Row. I don't know if you've ever been to Skid Row before in LA. It's terrible there. You can't walk at nighttime there. You need a security guard. Hmm. So where are you guys going after this? I don't know. Uh, we were Back thinking to of, Phoenix, I guess. We were thinking, to be honest, of going to film the border wall because we've never done that before. Uh, that's a good thing. Do you think we should do that? Yeah. I would. I yeah. Would. When are you going to come back down here? Yeah, right? Exactly, exactly. It's my first time out here to Arizona. So. <clears throat> but it's not, it's not dangerous, though, to film it, is it? Like, no. no. Not on this side. You've been to the Grand Canyon? Yeah. No. Well, I've been to the Grand Canyon. Cabin. I've been to Sedona. That's as close as I got. Sedona's beautiful. Yeah, I loved it there. I'm actually liking, like, Tucson and Phoenix area. It's so beautiful. Yeah. Like, the mountains and stuff. Where I'm from in Ottawa, we don't have mountains. Just flat and boring and snowy. <laughs> you guys got forest and... Yeah, we have nice forests. Yeah. They come in handy for Ren and Nautica videos. <laughs> Excuse me. But it gets boring after a while. Yeah. Once in a while you want to see a cool campus. Sorry it's taking so long. No worries. It's just I'm getting hungry. <laughs> what are we eating, Carlo? It's your pick today. No. I say Mexican. No. <laughs> he doesn't like Mexican food. <laughs> you guys ever see any rattlesnakes out here? Mm-hmm. I've been wanting to film. It's, uh, it's too cold right now. Oh, is it? Yeah. I've been wanting to film one forever, but we just never find no, them. They're, they're cold-blooded, so it's... Yeah. So there's, like, no chance of seeing them right now. No. You know, I'd be so scared out in the desert anymore. Oh, you still got javelinas and coyotes. And okay. Going to the mountains, you have bears. Bears? No way. Bears, bears. No, I'm not going anywhere in the desert. <laughs> no, mm. we're going, we're going. We're We've been in so many deserts already. Like, calm down. Why? We got bears in Kenya. Look at the fucking moose, bro. You ever seen a moose? You all good? That shit will destroy you. Alright. Alright. All right. You guys have a safe night, okay? Did you get your IDs back? Uh, no. Alright, here you go. Man. Thank you. You, you have a safe night, yeah? You have a great night. Sorry about the trouble, guys. We'll go inside. We won't look for elf on the shelf. That's what people call the cops on that. It's another. Alright, let's go. Oh, I'm actually being serious. I'm gonna identify with you. You good. Yeah, do it. It's really funny. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Alright guys, that was us running uh, a conversation with the police at the Serena Williams Training Academy. We're good. We got away. We're at a food place right now. I'm outside with Angelo. It's extremely late at night, so I'm going to end this video off. Thank you all for watching. All my links are down below. Don't forget to stay positive. Keep living that dream and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.